I gotta put my face in the thing. Let me tell y'all something. When I tell you I'm never washing my brushes the same again, like. Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Um, so, we are on day, I don't even know, of quarantine, and I decided that I want to clean my makeup brushes. Um, so I was scrolling through Twitter, and I saw this TikTok of this woman cleaning her brushes in a way that I had never seen before. And I was like, hmm, interesting. Okay, so um, I decided that I wanted to try this method, um, and it essentially consisted of... Dr. Bronner's, I know people are iffy about that, but I'm not putting it on my face, I'm putting it on the makeup brushes. I picked up this one, I, I think this is the, um, what flavor? I mean, not flavor. Hemp Rose, there you go. So I got the Hemp Rose uh, Dr. Bronner's, and then I got this little mesh strainer, believe it or not, this is what she used. Um, I got this from the Dollar Tree, so we finna see how this works. Um, before we get into the actual video of me washing my brushes, I'm going to show you guys the TikTok that I saw so you can see and so she can get credit. Okay, so without further ado, here is the TikTok. The soap you need for cleaning your brushes. This is the utensil you need. It's a sieve, just like for baking. And run a hot sink with the soap, dip your brush in, use the sieve to get rid of the product and boom, clean brush. Let's try it with a foundation brush. This is tougher to remove. Usually takes ages to clean. Use this method and it's clean in literally like five seconds. Let's try it with loads of brushes and no editing. This is literally the quickest way to wash your brushes. I've done it for years. Try it out for yourself. It's the best. All right, so now that you saw, hopefully you understand why I was so amazed. So what I'm gonna do is go try it. I'm gonna take you guys into my bathroom and hopefully it works, fingers crossed. Okay. One more thing, I know my hair looks weird. It's just cause it was wash day and I didn't feel like drying it or anything. So I'm just letting it air dry. It's probably gonna look crazy by the end of the video, but whatever. If you would like to see a wash day video, let me know in the comments. Okay, for real this time into the bathroom we go. All right, so I'm gonna start off with this little brush here, this flathead brush. Um, typically I use this for my powders. Um, so yeah, okay. Um, she took, it looked like she took this and added the little soap, the Dr. Bronner soap into it, I think. I don't know y'all. Um, and then like she just kind of swirled it in the thing and she said it was supposed to be fast wow hold on hold on hold on okay i think i need to add a little i think i need to add a little more so i'm gonna add some directly onto the brush hopefully that makes a little bit of a difference but this is pretty effective oh my gosh and i'm not even and i'm not even using water right now okay and i mean it's still a lot of product on there because I don't wash my brushes as often as I should. Don't judge me, but okay, let's see. Okay, okay, Piriana, Piriana. Um, I will say I'm having to add a little bit more um product than I think she did, but. Maybe it's because I got this little this little sifter thing from the Dollar Tree. What y'all think? I don't know. But let's keep trying. I'm going to add a little more on the little thing. And then I'm going to add some on the brush. I know you're not supposed to hold the brush upside down when you clean it. But whatever. Okay, now let's rinse it. Okay, I mean... It got, I feel like it got like the surface, I don't know. I feel like it got like the surface of the dirt and the makeup out, but it doesn't look like, I don't know. I don't know y'all, what y'all think? It's just brown still. I feel like she was able to get it off quicker than this. Maybe you can't be cheap with this little thing. Maybe you gotta get like a, 
I don't know. All right, I'm gonna try one more time. And if not, I'm gonna have to dud this because I don't know y'all. Okay, let's see, one more time. Oof. This is getting it cleaner. And I'm putting a little bit more elbow grease. Before I was trying to be all cute with it, but hold on. Oh, and you know what? She had water like kind of stopped up. So maybe I need to stop some water, but I feel like that's like cross contamination. I don't know. Let's see. What happens if I stop the water up and then like sit that in there? Okay, so I'm gonna stop the water up like this and then do it. But then that's just gonna make my sink nasty. I don't know. I mean, that definitely did better. No, I'm not stopping the sink up. This gross. All right, y'all. So um, after about like five rounds of using the soap and scrubbing it in this little mesh whatever <laughs> I don't know what's called but it just now got clean and there's still a little bit of dirt or makeup right there that I'm gonna have to do again so I would say six rounds I'm kind of disappointed because I thought it was gonna work um but yeah so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and try a small brush and see if that works better maybe the small brush works better we'll see okay so I went back and watched the video because I got really disappointed that it wasn't working and so i realized that she did run the water kind of like dishwater and then she put the soap in the water so maybe that works so i'm going to try it again with the um, this small brush right here and we're just going to see what happens so i'm just going to dip it okay i feel scammed because girl the way that stuff was coming off that brush, you would have thought that like, <laughs> maybe if I add some more soap, <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Okay, let's see. I feel played. Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> wait a minute. Ooh, ah, it worked. <gasps> oh, it worked. Oh my God. Okay, oh, okay, okay. Okay, one more, one more. Try a big one this time. Let's go back to the big one. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna try this big moment right here. Okay, so it's just gonna dip, dip into the water. <gasps> Yo, okay. Following instructions is fundamental because I just thought I was gonna get up in here and do what I wanted to do and I've been played. Yo, what? It's completely clean. Okay, it works, y'all. This works. I'm blown away. Blown away. Of course, the only downside is that you probably have to like go back through and rinse them. But like that's a that's a price that I'm willing to pay, I think, for you know how quick this is. Okay, so okay, let's do another big one. Okay. Oh my girl, shut the front door. Shut the front door. Look how nasty this water is though. Ugh. But like y'all, come on. <gasps> oh. Also, I think it has to do with how much product is on the brush too, you know? Uh, maybe that's a determining factor. I know that's a determining factor. So don't be filthy like me and wait and wait weeks at a time to wash your brushes because you know you're gonna struggle. So then she took a few. Sis said, not only can I do it with one, I can do it with 17. So we're gonna do it with 17. Well, not really 17, but you know, however many this is, I don't feel like counting. But all right, I'm gonna just keep it in the water. Girl, 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 girl. <gasps> Let me tell y'all something. I gotta put my face in the thing. Let me tell y'all something. When I tell you I'm never washing my brushes the same again, like, come through TikTok while wow. I'm literally blown away. These are like brand spanking new. Brand spanking new. This is insane. This is literally insane. So now that I know that it works, I'm gonna go ahead and speed this up, rinse them off, and then show y'all the finished product.
All right, so clearly this is a disgusting cesspool of dirt, skin, makeup, and all kinds of other stuff. Um, so what I'm going to do is obviously clean this out, um, and then I'm going to go back and rinse the brushes, and then leave them alone to dry. Right? Cool. Okay. All right, you guys, um, so I'm done washing my brushes. Uh, it was really fast. I think I did that in like 15, 10, 15 minutes. And usually like washing my brushes take anywhere from like 45 minutes to an hour. It's like a lot of scrubbing and rinsing and scrubbing and rinsing. And I almost felt like that was happening again. But once I went back and watched the video and followed the instructions correctly, it worked. So. Um, shout out to her because that is gonna save my life um, and also I think that also plays into like why I don't wash my brushes so much which I know that's so terrible but um, nobody wants to sit in the bathroom and wash brushes for an hour so that is going to be a lifesaver um, one note that I did notice is that when I went back to like rinse the brushes um, there was no soap left I don't know if like Dr. Bronner's if that's like a property of theirs like you kind of scrub and then the soap dissolves in the water. I don't know. But like when I went back to rinse the soap out, there was none, which was kind of weird for me. But whatever. Nonetheless, my brushes are clean. So that is definitely a method I'm using from now on. Definitely a lifesaver. Yeah. So thank you guys for tuning in. I hope this video helped you. But thank you for watching. Uh, please give this video a big thumbs up. Um, like the video, subscribe, comment, share, all the things that helps me a lot. So thank you guys. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Bye-bye.